Man receives millions of dollars after wife's infidelity, ah, North Carolina. It must be said that things operate differently there, and the population holds an unusual attitude towards marital infidelity. In nearly the entire Western world, cheating is not considered a crime. However, in the laws of the state of North Carolina, there's an article for alienation of affection, and it's quite lucrative. This was recently discovered by a man named Francisco Wizar. The court ordered him to pay Keith King $8. $8 million for having a romantic relationship with King's wife, Danielle Swords, over 16 months. King and his lawyer, Joanne Foyle, won the lawsuit, securing $6. $6 million in punitive damages and $2. $2 million in compensatory damages. King claimed that the affair caused his business to lose income and an employee, Danielle, who was, unsurprisingly, fired. The grounds for the lawsuit included adultery, family breakdown, intentional infliction of emotional distress, negligence, infliction of emotional distress, as well as assault and battery. Not so long ago, another story that swept the entire internet occurred you probably know about it. A man from a small town in southeast China decided that revenge is a dish best served cold. He waited until the wedding day to expose his wife and show all the gathered guests on a huge screen how she was cheating on him with her sister's husband. For five minutes, the couple's friends and family, including the pregnant sister whose husband was featured in the video, watched in complete silence. After being posted on social media, this video went viral among Chinese users. Some were shocked and thought the man went too far, while others believed it was the best form of revenge. During the video display at the wedding, the groom turned to the bride and said, you thought I didn't know? In response, she threw her bouquet at him. According to one of the guests, things only got worse from there. The groom asked the men to flip their plates, and if there was a red sticker underneath, they were to stand up. He then continued, Could you all please look at the eight gentlemen who stood up? All of them have slept with my wife since we got engaged, and I am going to annul this marriage. After that, he silently left the room.